it's Little Miss Bliss. The following contest is a false count anywhere match. Making her way to the ring. Here comes the queen. And from the Queen City, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Charlotte Flair. These competitors are squaring off, looking to outmatch each other. It's gonna be a tall task for one of these two. games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me. With the knee now. Nobody comes back from this. Executed neck breaker. Charlotte not in a good spot here. Nothing she can't fire back from though. Well, there's still plenty of match to go here, guys. Unless something crazy happens, I don't envision this being the end of the road for her. She goes for the cover. Charlotte gets the shoulder up. She's still in this one. Charlotte Flair has a natural ability that most WWE superstars yearn for. How can any competitor even hope to challenge the Queen, Byron? Well, Charlotte is a fast learner and has the greatest of all time as her mentor, but I think capitalizing on inexperience is the best move. Look at this. She's so dangerous. Oh, there's the old... Right, and I don't even know if there are any gaps left in Charlotte's knowledge. She may have fewer years in the ring, but she learns at an incredible rate. So you need more years in the ring and a better mentor than Ric Flair? Ah, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Air whip! I'm not sure Charlotte should be showing up for competition like this. In control, here's Charlotte. The queen is showing why she is genetically superior. Real quick, in case we have any newbies watching, a false count anywhere match means that this contest can literally... And Charlotte makes the cover. Digging deep for a kick out. Hey, I guess you never know. Yeah, she's getting after it, showing great energy. Look out. There she goes. Oh, man, by the hair. Oh, no. She's in a bad way now. In describing this match, Corey, you said it can end anywhere, which means we could see this match conclude in the ring, yeah. the stands, the locker room. Heck, it could even out end outside the streets. And, and on top of that, it's worth noting that anything is legal in this match, guys. The only rule is there are no rules. Charlotte Flair has so many high-profile victories in both WWE and NXT. Corey, how does... Here's a cover. She goes for the cover. Two. Alexa Bliss looks to finish this one early. Two. Looking to steal one there, perhaps. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. Charlotte. Bam! She got her good there. Things do not look good for Alexa Bliss. Corey, going back to those emotions, Charlotte isn't afraid to shed tears when she's truly moved. But I can see moments where she... Is that it? Is it over? Scissors kick! Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. Charlotte's just getting overwhelmed. That's not something you see often for the Queen.
Will this be enough? The WWE Mixed Match Challenge made for some strange teams, but perhaps the weirdest duo in the entire tournament was Alexa Bliss and the Monster Among Men, Braun Strowman. Yeah, the WWE Universe gave Bliss and Braun the name Team Little Big, and the numbers don't lie. Braun is almost two feet taller than Bliss and almost 300 pounds heavier. Fire him. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. And Saxton, even more impressive than Bliss and Braun's size difference is their teamwork. They beat the two toughest gingers in WWE when they defeated Becky Lynch and Sami Zayn in tag team competition. Their win wasn't a huge shock. Yes, it was. What was a shock, Corey, was Bliss and Braun admitting that they found each other cute. Well, that's a strange couple to sit behind. I thought strange is beautiful, Byron. Charlotte is rolling here. Talk about sending a message. What power, what a slam, what damage. What's oh, coming next? The shoulders. Oh, uh -oh. no. Backpack stunner. When she gets in attack mode, look out. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Insult to injury. Game, set, match. Th this could do it. One, two, three. The pinfall and the victory. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch Here again winner, and again Alexa and again. Epic. Bliss. And there's your winner. I don't make the matches, but if I did, I'd put these two back in the ring ASAP. What an amazing match. And I can imagine there aren't too many people at home regretting tuning in for that amazing match.